Metro Manila Skyway Section 2B. A key plank of the government's overall road infrastructure program to decongest Metro Manila, faces delay after a portion being constructed collapsed on Saturday, February 1st, following a big fire in Pandacan, Manila. 3. Span of the Skyway was accidentally on fire. The construction is 90% completed during that time. And because of the fire incident the completion will push to another 3 to 5 months extension. San Miguel Corporation is pushing the completion of the project end of year 2020 even in a hard time of pandemic and fire incident. The demolition was started after a week happened. Everyone is aiming the 2020 completion. The plan is to start demolition of the slab to expose the beam. Plan it will take one to two months to complete the demolition. As beam exposed, it's time to lower it to have a safe demolition of the comping beam and column. Demolition works 24-7 to complete it on time. This time demolition of first span is completed and two more to go. The demolition is on track as per plan. This hard time pandemic is also one of the challenge for all. After a month of demolition, reconstruction will start. Construction is start from column to slab. After one and a half month, one pier reconstructed, and now installing the UV steel girder. construction of two more piers was continued.
Thank you to all parties who helped this construction complete. After more challenging part of the Metro Manila Skyway Stage 3, the construction is now 95% as of November 2020, and possible to open this coming December. This is a great achievement for Tudert administration. With the help of San Miguel Corporation and its contractor, Good luck Philippines and Mavuhek.